what's going on ladies and gentlemen welcome back to the channel my name's cryptic and if you guys haven't been here before we do a lot of gameplay videos a lot of highlights from our live streams and we also make some tips and tricks every once in a while when the need arises and this is one of those times vidiq is an online website that has video tutorials as well as analytics about your youtube channel to help you grow now this website is also a Google Chrome extension, which I highly recommend you install and check it out, see how you like it for yourself. Today we're going to be going over some of the features that it has, as well as some of the premium options, should you like it enough that you want to expand your growth through their premium options. It's often been related to TubeBuddy, which is a similar site, but I find vidIQ has a few more features uh, based off of the free account that will get you going and help you as a content creator. All right, you guys, so now we're taking a look at the vidIQ dashboard. As you can see, it has a couple different windows here uh, that kind of have their own set of information. Uh, for instance, we have our channel stats here uh, where you can see your views, subscribers, watch time, all that good stuff. Uh, we also have a monetization tracker, which is basically the same information that you find on your monetization tab in the YouTube studio. So, you know, your subscribers, your watch time in the last 12 months and all time. So you can see that uh, nice and clear. We also have this window here called keyword opportunities. Now, these are words or phrases that can be found to help you in your videos, uh, given the other uh, tags that you've used or uh, you know they've used a tag in one video and it, you know there's another uh, phrase or phrases uh, that could be useful for those videos so for example uh, we recently did a halo infinite stream so we have halo infinite and you know it's got a big search volume uh, medium competition uh, overall it's rated a 73 out of 100 uh, basically, these are ratings based off of search history, uh, how well videos are doing, how other, how many other videos uh, are being used with those same tags, that kind of thing. Uh, so, you know, we have Halo Infinite, Halo Infinite Multiplayer, Halo Infinite Gameplay, that kind of stuff. So th this is a very useful tool, especially when you're trying to figure out what kind of tags you should be using. So definitely highly recommend using that as an option. As we scroll down, we have competitors, which these are just some uh, YouTubers that I like to compare myself to uh, just to see how things go. Obviously, I'm a much smaller channel, but I like aiming big so that way I can see what I'm doing right, what I'm doing wrong. Uh, you know, we got Mythros here, Jim Ventures, uh, great YouTubers. I definitely recommend checking them out. Um, but you, you can kind of use these and these are personal settings so you can put whoever you want really uh, in there but I figured I'd do them they're great people great youtubers highly recommend them but scrolling down more we have top videos for your channels uh, or from your channel so these are my videos that have been doing well over the last 30 days uh, you can see their views uh, the views per hour watch time all that good stuff and as you can see here, we have some windows that are kind of blocked off with an upgrade to vidIQ Pro. These are the premium options that I mentioned uh, earlier on. Uh, basically, you can pay a subscription to gain access to that uh, subscriber overview as well as oh, that's all subscriber view. So that's it for the dashboard here. Uh, some of the features that I have, you know, we talked about the channel stats, keyword opportunities. Uh, but what they also have is they have this tab here called daily ideas. Now, basically what it does is it gives you a list of X amount of ideas, depending on if you have the free or premium version. Uh, I believe the free one gives you three ideas daily. So as you can see, we have first game back with the hunt. Uh, they're predicting that the view prediction will be very high. Uh, Apex Legend at its finest. A high amount of views and sea of thieves but it's actually fun that one's a medium and you can choose to either keep these or dismiss them uh if you dismiss them on the free account you don't get any more until the next day but if you have the premium version you get to have um i believe an unlimited amount of ideas generated 
and then you also have you know your saved ideas so I, i've got a whole bunch of different ones that i thought were good i've also had some dismissed ones so if you you know dismissed one and you find out that you probably might actually like it uh no worries it, it's all here you can just hit restore going on to the next tab we have the keywords tab uh these words are the top keyword opportunities and top search terms for your channel so top keyword opportunities are basically keywords that can be used that they think will do well in your video and help boost your video in the search engine optimization or seo you also have the top search terms for your channel which is basically the top search terms that people are looking up and finding your videos very useful and you know basically what you get from that is if that keyword or a key phrase is doing well continue using them in the videos that cover those topics again we see the competitors tab here uh, that basically just gives a little more in-depth uh, view over your competitors so for example you know you can see how they're doing versus yourself me way down there but that's okay we're just getting into it but you can see subscribers public videos average daily views that kind of stuff um so it, it's very useful and I, I think people underestimate the seo and uh kind of analytics so kind of going through this is very useful um if you guys want we can take a better look at analytics through the youtube studio and kind of how it relates to vidiq but uh let me know down in the comments if you guys want something like that so all these are great analytics like i said if you want to have um the premium option where you get the subscribers uh and stuff you can see here that they have a couple different price points um pro boost um I, i'd say if anything you were to go with any of them i'd say using uh boost would be helpful um but if you're just beginning out i'd say the free plan is you know better just because you know you don't have to worry about a subscription fee or anything like that truth be told the tools are very useful i myself have been using them and they've helped tremendously uh with my growth and seeing how things uh work on the search engine optimization so overall i think this tool is very useful like i said it is a google chrome extension so you can have it right up here at the vidiq vision for youtube um it's very useful i find that you know whether you understand the analytics or not it there's enough here where you can figure out what you're doing well and areas that you can improve on if you are interested they also have a vid iq academy so you know when you log in you they can go through how to use the i vid iq um how to set up a youtube filming space uh they got a whole bunch of different courses uh you know they got sean connell uh a whole bunch of great youtubers that kind of help you through the tutorial process so before we finish up with this video, I did want to show you guys what the vidIQ plugin looks in from the YouTube studio side. Uh, usually you just have, you know, the dashboard content all the way down to the audio library. But if you scroll down with the plugin, you know, you get those tabs that we were talking about earlier, uh, daily ideas, keyword inspector, uh, competitors. They also have trend alerts. So like you can see how, um, you know, different keywords rack um i haven't done too much with that so we'll probably do a video later on once i get a grasp of it um you can also see your most viewed videos excuse me that's most viewed out of youtube and you can see how those stack up through uh, other videos uh this bulk seo option is a premium option so unless you get the premium option you cannot access that some of the things that i personally like is the channel audit it basically shows you what content you should be working on so for instance this month our hard fought arena win apex legends ranked arena gameplay did pretty well uh the views were there um you know we got some subscribers based on these videos and the views per hour is doing pretty well on here it also shows you your views month on month 
subscribers month on month and minutes watched month on month. It's very cool, very simply explained. Um, and you know, this information is good to help you figure out which, you know, videos or topics you should be covering. They also have an achievements tab here where you can, you know, you reach certain milestones. Like we're almost hitting uh, 6K views by February uh, 5th. So that's always cool. You know, we reached our 100 subscriber mark, 200 uploads, that kind of stuff. That's just like fun little pat yourself on the back kind of thing. Now there's one feature that I really, really like, and it's going to be in the content tab but it's when you uh take a look at the tags on your video so this is uh our stream highlights uh video that we posted a little bit back um you know we got our thumbnails and you can even create a thumbnail using vidIQ so that's very useful uh as you can see here on the side it tells you the vidIQ SEO score basically what that means is how it stacks up uh with your SEO whether it's you know good whether it's uh needing some work and they actually have a checklist here that can help you out so at least one card one end screen closed captioning uh monetization enabled uh added to a playlist make public uh replied to a recent comment those kind of things it helps uh with engagement that kind of stuff so uh the one feature that i was talking about is gonna be these templates here these templates are probably the most useful thing that i have used on vidIQ so if we click on it as you can see i have a couple different templates uh we got apex split gate pirates online new world warzone super people cod basically what these are is a collection of tags that you can put together in a grouping essentially so that when you're you know live streaming or making a new video if it's dealing with you know um with apex you know we got apex legends apex gameplay apex legends gameplay you know all these different tags relating to apex i can put them in a group and instantly put them in to um our tags so as you can see here we have you know gaming uh, YouTube gaming Warzone, apex legends ranked um, these first couple ones are based off of my specific channel basically all these are from the grouping that we made for apex as well as cod because this is an apex and Warzone uh, highlight so it's very cool very uh, easy it, it speeds up the process of getting your videos ready or going live and having those tags ready because if you start live streaming and you don't have those tags you know if people look up apex you know that video is not going to show up for those tags um so putting I, I highly recommend putting tags in before you start streaming like if you uh are streaming on youtube and you put your starting soon screen up and you know you got a countdown and everything i highly recommend popping open your youtube studio and putting those tags in that way you can start your live stream and people can find you right away rather than you know looking back at the vod because nine times out of ten people don't watch vods of live stream for the most part people watch live streams when they're live obviously so having those tags there will help you get in front of more people quicker now, same thing here, uh, you know, we have recommended tags. Uh, these are great for uh, if you have a whole bunch of different uh, kind of topic based tags and you, you think there might be more that you can add, uh, you can go ahead and just click the plus here and it'll add it in. But uh, obviously we don't have Roblox on that, so we're not gonna do that. And you also have a refresh tab, so you can refresh them. That obviously didn't refresh any of them for whatever reason. So thank you guys so much for watching this video if you guys want me to go more in depth on certain topics definitely let me know in the comments or let me know in our discord which you can find a link for it down below uh we do stream live on youtube gaming as of right now tuesday wednesday and thursday starting at 12 p.m eastern standard time so if you guys want to ask questions uh you know while i'm live i'm more than happy to answer those and uh, kind of go through it 
uh as you know we play some games or maybe even take a break and you know do a live q a kind of thing 